the Duchess of Sussex rushed to help a coughing woman who sat behind her at the UN headquarters on Monday. Meghan was sitting next to her husband Prince Harry when she heard a fellow member of the audience starting to cough. Acting quickly, she turned toward the coughing person and offered her own bottle of water. The Duchess was caught on camera as she passed on the bottle and let the member of the audience take a few sips from it. After the bottle was returned to her, Meghan exchanged a few words with the two people sitting behind her and her husband. This kind gesture was praised by fans of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. One, at Debrazen underscore Hussey, wrote on Twitter, Meghan giving her bottle of water to the lady behind her. Always kind, nd, caring. Another Twitter user, at Rani of Justice, said, to offer your bottle of water to another woman who is coughing tells me more of Duchess Meghan's character, than any hit piece book written about her. This fan of the Duchess appeared to refer to the upcoming publication of Tom Bauer's new biography focused on the former actress, titled Revenge, Meghan, Harry and the War Between the Windsors. Extracts from the book published over the past few days by The Times have included potentially damaging claims against the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Upon their arrival at the UN headquarters on Monday afternoon, the couple was asked a question regarding the book, to be released on Thursday, by a journalist. UN correspondent for Voice of American Margaret Beshear asked, Prince Harry, are you worried that Tom Bauer's new book is going to wide a tall rift with the royal family? Both Harry and Meghan only glanced at the journalist and, without replying, they kept walking inside the building. This morning, more pictures of Meghan and Harry's day in New York emerged. The Duchess was spotted leaving Crosby Hotel in Soho hand in hand with feminist Gloria Steinem, with whom she is believed to have struck a friendship in the summer of 2020. Later on Monday, the Duke and Duchess were photographed leaving a restaurant owned by actor Robert De Niro serving chef Andrew Carmelini's menu.